Good morning, everybody. Today's travels bring us here to the Calico Ghost Town. We are got the dogs, we got the kids, and we're about to go and explore and have some fun, and we're gonna bring you along with us. So let's go. These are some of the attractions they have here. The Maggie Mine Tour, Mystery Shack Tour. They even have a cemetery. A little gift store, Enchanted Cottage. Might swing back by later and check that out because I know the kiddos want to go to the gift store. Look at that old guy. He's just sitting out to say hi. Hey buddy, how you doing? Just hanging out? Just greeting everybody? All right. Hey look, you guys need a job? They're hiring. Oh, restaurant here. Biscuits and gravies, flapjacks, half pound hamburgers, barbecue beef sandwiches. Man, that all sounds good, huh? But look at that. Restaurant is closed. But we can go to Lil's Saloon. Guys thirsty? This is the fire hall. And look at that guy. You guys can imagine this rushing up to the house to come put the fire out? Got your, hook your horses on the front here. That water tank looks a little small though. I'm not sure how much they'd be able to put out. I have a swing. Pretty cool. Calico Ghost Town population. Look at this, 1881, there was 40. What, 2081? Mm -hmm. Wow, they can go into the future. But in 1981, 15. Look at this. History in 1881. Looks like a tiny jail. Yeah, most of the jails back then were pretty small. Remember the jail we saw down in Coloma? Mm -hmm. Little model display here of the town of what once was. Right, look at the one on the end. It's it's a it's a big one. Oh, that's a big one. Right here, buddy. Here you go. This is you. Look at that. Let's see. Is that you? That's you. <laughs> Look at those hats. You need one of these, dude. Look at that. <laughs> yeah. It's not bad. Magnets and keychains. Toys and stuff in here. Hey, you guys might find uh, Granny's name on here. Got a candle shop over there. Calico print. Definitely have the Halloween theme going on. The old miner. at this guy. He's out of order though. He looks like he's out of order. Ooh. A lot of cool buildings and stuff. Oh look, sheriff's office is over there. But when you guys come here, you gotta watch out because look at this guy. They have dinosaurs in the ghost town. It makes sense though, we're in a ghost town. Dinosaurs are ghosts now. Drugstore. No spitting, no drinking, no loose women. The Zenda Mining Company. Man, look at that old wheelbarrow. Information. Old mining stuff. A 
we were cruising to head over here to the, go check out the train ride and we noticed all these buildings on the side of the hills. Look at all those, Maggie's Mine. And then they got more buildings up here in the side of the rocks. Train's leaving a couple Wow, of pretty cool. Okay. Information yeah. about the mine. Look at these guys back here. Old singing Sam. For a buck, he'll sing you a tune. Granny's birthday is coming up, so everywhere we go, the kids are trying to find more stuff for Granny for her birthday. So, kids are having fun. Right now, they're looking for names. We got Grandma. No Granny. No Trish. No. We'll keep finding. We'll find something. We'll find something. This is Hard Rock Harris. Right now we're on the Calico train going on a ride. Whoa, look at that guy. He didn't survive the last train ride. He's he's just he fell out the window. Ugh. Ugh. Oh my gosh, look at that. Who is that? Is that the ghost rider? Oh my god, look at this guy. This guy is scary. Look at the dog! What kind of dog is that? With almost a oh, it stinks over here, Evan. Oh, it must be those skunks. What the heck? Hey, it looks just like Molly. <laughs> whoa, whoa. Scary. I wonder it's a ghost town. Everyone's just dead. This is an ore crusher called an Aristotle. Miners would hitch a horse or mule to that crossbar. Oh, look at that. Hey, look, there's our house down there. the steel ball to drag over and crush the ore before it was taken to a processing mill. Of course, by the 1880 towns, it may no longer be visible. But when the boom ended here, some miners got jobs over there. Now don't forget to mosey over to the Maggie Mine. I hear there's a great tour over there, too. Train ride. Thank you. You're welcome. You have a chance to get a with the guard. It will give you a mini education on the minerals Calico is famous for. Ooh, look at that. We used black light in the showcase to highlight what would otherwise be pretty bland looking material. Modern miners use ultraviolet light to sort specimens, but in the glory days of a Maggie mine, only the sure knowledge and experience of a miner could find pay dirt and high grade ore. We are now inside the mountain. We're inside Maggie's mine now. Inside the mountain, how cool is that? It's kind of scary. Look at this. That's one of those things, like you see that rod on the end there? Mm -hmm. That looks like one of those things Grandpa has at home, because he used to be a miner. Mm -hmm. You know, and they they dynamite and they'd stick those things in there and it has the hollow and they shoot the water in it. And that's how they're able to like drill inside there. Mm -hmm. Keep up the good work, buddy. We'll see you next time. We're gonna go right.
Shoot one, stand clear on the barrel, on three bells. This is the ore shoot. Shoot two. out guys for silver nuggets guys wait up for me I'm scared <laughs> this is the $65,000 glory hole this is where she said $65,000 was stolen look at that guy is he stealing it now man he's pretty strong look how that looks heavy I don't even think I could move that oh I guess so. Home of the, what's it say? McCauley Brothers. McCauley Brothers, look at those guys. They look old, they've been here a long time. Hey, I think we have a blanket just like that. This was their actual room though, guys. Yeah. This is where they actually lived in this little tiny area in here. Pretty crazy, huh? Can you imagine that being your bedroom? Pretty crazy. There's the kiddos. You guys want some and can have some with lunch. You guys see how this is different than Bodhi? They've actually, they use the buildings and still do stuff with it. Dorsey Dog House. You guys want to check it out? Well, yeah, you guys are dog lovers. Let's go check out the dog house. Hey, buddy, how are you? Dorsey Dog House. Hey, little guy. They made a misspelled Dorothy. You guys might find something for Granny over there. Uh, welcome to Dorothy's. Hello, how you doing? I'm good, how are you guys? Good. We saw this, these kiddos are dog lovers, so we had to come stop we by. We absolutely are, this is their store. I like to say, they're our customers, you guys are their ticket. <laughs> no, we're actually just uh, passing through. I homeschool them, we're like road school, so we're out traveling around and- We're getting a better education that way. Oh yeah. Public school. Oh yeah, we're going, we're having all kinds of fun. They get to meet all different kinds of people. Yeah, and see different things, get hands on. Yep. Did you guys find anything with Granny's name on it? Over here. She'd like that. It's our Granny's birthday too when we get back. Oh. So they're, everywhere we go, they're finding little things. You guys know where a bathroom is? Oh, I found it. Look at this. We go right there. Oh, he's got some teepee as well. Look at that. The old outhouse. All right, well that was fun. We just left the Calico Ghost Town. It's a, it's a pretty touristy type place. Nothing like Bodie if you've ever been to Bodie. Most of the buildings are, they got some work done to them and there's little stores and stuff in each one. Pretty cool. We were there about four hours, but we had lunch and stuff. And then we ended up taking the dogs for a walk as well. Um, but we had a good time. 
It was nice and cool this morning, but man, it's hot. We're sweating now. One cool thing is though, is they do have a dump station on the way out. Didn't know that. So we just left the dump station and we were heading off to our next destination. So down the road we go.